Michigan, Georgia. The battle is going to be in the trenches. Can the Michigan Wolverines run the ball? Can Georgia stop the run? And that's the test. That's the test. Quarterback um, is a position that I'm not too focused on at this point, but the true test for Georgia and Michigan is going to whoever's going to run the ball well and who's going to stop the run. And at this point, I don't think quarterback is going to play a factor. Um, I obviously think that Bulldogs have the advantage. Um, despite how I feel about Stetson Bennett, he's obviously the better quarterback in this uh, game. So based on that alone, I got to go with the dogs um, because they obviously have a better defense. They had a better running game. Zeus, um, Milton, uh, John, uh, uh, what the hell his name is? Whatever his name is. Uh, at this point, he's going to have uh, a big game, and I don't think Michigan have enough to stop Georgia in its entirety. The receivers, the tight end, um, the offensive line, you know, they have a good defensive line, a uh, good defensive end, but I just don't think they have enough for Bulldogs, and I'm picking the Bulldogs. Um, might be biased, but I just don't think Michigan has enough to keep up with Bulldogs at this point, especially with a 300 and 50 pound defensive tackle who can move around and they're going to have uh, a lot of issues trying to match up uh, with him whether it's um, Jordan Davis, Wyatt they're going to have some problems to match up with Georgia um, Nicole Dean, other guys like they, they Michigan just going to have a lot of problems they're going to have to play mistake free football, uh, run the ball well and I just don't think you could do that against the Georgia Bulldogs team. And that's all I got to say about that. Let me know what y'all think about that, man. I'm out of here.